a capital gains tax. How would that fit into your negotiation with her? Uh, I would say, um, Suzette, um, so did you already uh, take the recapture on the depreciation? I think so. My accountant is supposed to do that, but I think so, yes. You think so? Okay, so I, I would definitely revisit my, my accountant because it does look like you may have to pay um, some recapture ta tax on the, um, on the depreciated amount that you did. Now, if you did pay that, uh, Suzette, would that, uh, would that end this deal for us? Would, um, would this be over or maybe not? Yeah, it depends on the amount that I would have to pay back because I really don't want to pay any, any depreciation back. How soon can you call your accountant about that? How, when, can, when can we close up on this? Um, you know, I'd like to have an answer one way or another. Um, I could probably call her today to see if they can answer me today. Oh, fantastic, fantastic. So if I called you back, say around five o'clock, um, uh, could we move forward on, 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 on our decision one way or another? Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, sounds good. So when I call you back, we'll we'll know yes or no. Yes, I I have a better idea how much I would have to pay, and then I'll decide whether I want to sell or not. I'll okay, you know. great. Well, I, I look forward to speaking with you at five o'clock. Yep. Thank you. Okay. So now you, at least you have some more info, and that was great. Thank you. I, I knew in this group uh, we have over thirty-two screens here. There had to be one person, and it was Mr. Walker, uh, <laughs> who had the knowledge here, and that's great. Um, on that. Always learn something new here. Are you, are you an accountant also, Victor? I didn't... Uh... I, I'm not an accountant, no. Okay, that's just something general knowledge you picked yeah, up. Just, yeah, just kind of search uh, for it. Absolutely. Always want to get the commitment from them, or I could do the research for you, or could we have a meeting together with your accountant today at 1230? Mm -hmm. Something. You want to keep that connection. You say, you say I will do the research for you. What would what would trigger something like that? Because I, I tend to avoid, you know, trying to do, you know, more than I need to in terms of that because of our schedule and everything else that goes with that. I mean, it would have to it would have to kind of be a payday situation for me, right? You you answered your own question. Is it a, <laughs> a $500 day or a $50,000 right. day? Do you yeah. is it a bad month and you need $5,000 and, and this person might help you to get there? Do, yeah. you know, it, it really depends on your personal financial situation. You know, we have good months and bad months, right? Yeah, yeah. Sometimes, you know, do you ever have a bad month and the bills are coming in and it's the 28th of May and you said, I better do a few of those deals that I really didn't want to do or something like that. Oh, that's, a, that's so good. That's it, good. You know, you know, it's a, it's really a, a judge. I wish, you know, everybody wants those. Uh, what do they call it? The cookie cutter method. Can mm -hmm. we really use a solid template for all the deals, all the strategies, <laughs> all the negotiations? Can we really put it down to one template? No. I wish we could. I wish we could. I wish we could. It's really subjective. And um, it depends. If, see, the thing I look for is the commitment word. Can I get that specific commitment? a really hard commitment today. And I'm going to lean on her a little. Okay, when you say yes, you mean that if we can solve your depreciation problem, you and I can do a deal for $500,000, you hold a $200,000 note, I refinance your $300,000 or take over the payments. And we, you're the only person on the contract. So I can send you a sign today. And uh, by 4.30 this afternoon, problems are solved. Is that correct? I might, that is... Part of your closing technique has to summarize everything and get that specific commitment, either another meeting or a commitment to do the deal if, or something like that. I want to know, like, we're not wasting our time. Yeah. How much time do we waste on, oh, this sound, you know, the honeymoon period, oh, everything's yeah. wonderful, and, and you don't want to rock right. the boat or anything like that? Yeah with a prospect. Yeah. Oh, whatever you want. This is wonderful. Oh, it's so nice to meet you. What a beautiful family you have. I love your 10 chihuahuas and everything. And well, you know, I'll call you. Uh, oh, you said the near distant future. Oh, I, what is that? Is that is that next week? Uh, is it 2022? Uh, when is that? You know, when are we going to talk again? Yeah. Oh, I'll get back to you pretty soon. You know, boom. What what does that mean? It's not. Well, I've been having I've been having a lot of conversations with 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 um you know some of the people I JV with some students and stuff that they're kind of not focused on anything in particular, right? 